to Christ. I heard him say worship is still a privilege. You still get to choose. But very soon you're not going to be able to choose. Yeah, Christmas coming up. Yeah, New Year's coming up. Well, on the Gregorian calendar, New Year's already came. On the Hebrew calendar, which is what God uses. And very soon, you're going to see an implementation of something bigger than a mass. I heard the Lord say, Go and tell the people that it's time to receive Him as Savior and Lord God while there's time. He said, go and tell them that it doesn't matter which crowd they're in, that they're feeling safe being in, whether it be a job, whether it be a family, whether it be a business, it doesn't matter what crowd you're hiding in right now, thinking life is going on, business as usual. God says every single man will give account for himself. You can't expect anyone, absolutely anyone, to stand up for you. Thank you, Daddy. Ha! Ah. Okay, so we just asked the sun to go down and the sun went down. I can't carry down the umbrella. I heard him say, come to him while it's time. Choose him while it's day. You can't hide in your crowds. You can't hide in your jobs. You can't hide in your businesses or your family. Your husband, your wife, your granny, your nana, your nana, your auntie, your uncle. Nobody can stand up for you when God says, why didn't you? Why didn't you receive my blood shed on the cross? Nobody can stand for you and say, well, this is at this home. God says, you ought to be born again by the water and the Holy Spirit. That's your choice if you want to go to heaven. Now, heaven and hell is a consequence of your choices. You get to choose whether you want Jesus or not. But you don't get to choose if you're going to hell if you don't choose him. I heard the Lord saying, go and warn the people that every single man will give account for himself. He said every single man will give account for himself. You can't ask your pastor to stand up for you. You can't ask your husband or your wife. You can't say, well, I was Hindu all my life, or I was Muslim all my life, and I was Buddhist all my life. Jesus said, I am the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Before Abraham was, I am. He said, there is no other name on the heaven and earth by which you are saved. Nothing else will do. It's the blood of Christ that you need. And if the blood doesn't wash you, then the spirit of the living God doesn't fill you up. And then Satan will have a field here with you. Repent for homosexuality is a sin. It's an abomination in the sight of God. Very soon, there's going to be hate crimes. Like what I'm telling you about Jesus, what I'm telling you about God's word, it's going to be persecuted. You're going to see people calling up the police or whoever to take you down because you're preaching Christ. They call you a terrorist and extremist. They call me the resistance. I'm against the system. I'm standing up for my father's kingdom, which is what every single person who call themselves Christian is supposed to be doing. Every single one who says Jesus Christ is your Savior and your Lord God, you're supposed to be preaching the gospel. You're supposed to be doing it. 
Auntie. Auntie, can I pray please? Yeah? Where's the pain? Where's the pain? In your foot? In your knees? In your head? Your head as well? Okay, so he's telling me your head, right? What's your name? Molly. Molly? Who's that? Father God, I lift up Molly before you, Jesus, and I thank you that you Lord God. Father, even so, as you cover her in your precious blood, I just speak for Molly's feet to be healed right now, her entire leg, and her hip, Lord God, right where you reveal that you're about to heal it. So hip, be made whole now. Muscles, tendons, ligaments, bones, nerves, align to the word of God in his name, Jesus Christ, now. I command creative miracle, restore this hip by fire and by force. Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord, for doing it. No more pain. Molly, receive it. Receive it. Check it out and see. Come take a walk and tell me. How feel like? Yeah? So like 10 being the highest amount of pain and 0 being none. You can hold this one. Just hold this one. Uh, how much of this? Oh, it's... Uh, uh, really, when I'm walking, I don't think about the pain. I just want... But tell me, like, if you feel the discomfort now. Yeah, no, 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 no. It's gone? Yeah. You sure? Completely? Yeah. All right. So, of course, I was going to pray again and make sure it's completely gone. Yes. Yeah, All right. So, Father God, we just seal up Molly's healing by the blood of you, Jesus Christ. I cancel doctor's reports over you that said you'll never recover and you'll have to go with this pain forever. Yeah. And I speak God's report over you by the stripes of him, Jesus Christ, you're healed. Jesus' name. Yeah. Are you Christian? No. You need to come to Christ, though. Yeah, but I don't. Uh, he I is. He is anymore. God. Who came down yeah, he is. as a man Everywhere. because we are in the flesh yeah. and he was the perfect man. So he walked out your life perfectly. Yeah. Yeah. He walked out my life perfectly and he walked out your life perfectly. So when we receive him, we get his good reports. So when he goes as he's as God now, we can't see him. He's away from our sight. He looks at us, he sees his righteousness. That's how we enter into heaven. Do you see how that goes? He's God all by himself. Yes. What about you? What do you want him to do for you? I have him. Amen. I have him. Yes, you have him inside. I have him always. I walk it, go to church and come back home. Awesome. Do you want him to do anything for you at all? No, no, I do. I do. Where do you go to church? It's for us. Huh? Church. Montrose. 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 I also go to a church in Montrose, upstairs Avian Plaza. Montrose. No, um, World Harvest, no, Spread Tower. Montrose. It's, it's weird. Shishan. You go to church too? No, I don't. He goes. I, I go. Auntie, the, yeah, here's what God says. Huh? Before you close your eyes and leave this planet, you have to receive Christ. I because, do. I do. listen, believe in your heart and confess with your mouth mm. that He is Lord. And you shall be saved. Forsake religion and tradition because that's the lie of Satan. Sure. You want my number? Um, you can check my number. <laughs> I don't think he was going for that, but I'll go and give you my number anyway. Check on type and upside it down. It's funny. It's okay. <laughs> Phone or SIM? Uh, SIM. Carrie. Okay, Carrie. Carrie Christian. Okay. Yeah. Dust to the most high. Servant of her. His daughter. Because Jesus Christ is God. Very soon I can't do this anymore. You're already coming up. Yeah. You have a good night today. You too. Be blessed and enjoy your pain free body, alright? Can you walk without a cane? Come. Yes, you can. Come on. Come on. Take a step. Oh, okay. I want you to walk without the cane. No, I do when I'm home. No, I want you here, right now, to walk without the cane. I prayed for a guy who got um, a stroke. He was seriously bent up. He started to run. <laughs> Jesus is alive. God on him. Yes. God on him. God. Faith. Faith. His faith. He had faith to be healed. So first he started to walk and then I took him by the hand and I said, run. Let me just run. Sure. You see, you got to have a testimony of him. You got to have a testimony of him.
The Bible says we overcome Satan by the blood of Jesus Christ and the word of our faith in Jesus Christ, which is our testimony. The Bible says that the testimony of Jesus is the spirit of prophecy, which is what I'm operating under, which is what every single Christian is supposed to be filled with. I heard him say, come to him. We're still going through Hanukkah. We're on the sixth day, I think. We're on the sixth day of Hanukkah. And the fires from the throne room are falling. There's an anointing falling. There's a sanctification happening. God is doing what no man can do. He is about to show up in mighty ways and shift up certain things and shake down certain things and build it up the way that it was meant to be. God said, come unto him. Run to him. While there's time, you got a little time left. A very small window. Ah, uh, don't wait till you see lightning flashing in the sky. Daylight can't even hide his light. The sun is to hide in shame when Jesus is coming. Don't wait till the earth begins to tremble. And you see the Son of Man, Son of God, because he's fully man, fully God, coming on the clouds of glory. This mass system is in Revelation 13. It is written in Revelation 13. For those who trust the word of God, they're going to know exactly. How did it say come to him? Get your report. Get your assurance. Get hope in. Get strength. Build up yourself on the foundation that is true, that is everlasting, while there's time. God bless you, love. I heard it. By faith, God is well pleased. Come on, it only takes faith. And you don't get it from anything or anybody else but God himself. Faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word. If you would just pick up your Bible and begin to read Genesis to Revelation, set yourself to it. You'll be doing your soul an eternal favor. Pick up your Bible and begin to read it. Don't just read it when you feel a presence that's not supposed to be there. You're running for Psalms 91. No, pick up your Bible and read it. Read it like, like it's food that you need to eat. If you like cheesecake like me, pick it up and read it like eating cheesecake, right true, all the time. Jesus loves you. I heard him say, you've got to get the word in. While there's time, the Bible is becoming an illegal thing. An illegal thing. Anybody in possession of a Bible is soon going to be locked up. Yeah, that's what they're planning. You got to come to God while it's time. Else they're going to make you bow down to things. That is not God. Jesus loves you. He's God. Jesus loves you. He's Lord God. Jesus loves you. Well, tell me where to reach. Eh? Ten be in the highest amount of pain and zero be in none at all. Tell me where to reach. You feel it any? You feeling any? It's gone completely out your foot. Give him glory. Do something you couldn't do. Move it, mash it, mash it, mash, mash. It. Move. Take a walk. Wait, wait, wait. Which side? I'm going so. All right, let me go. Let me go. Come. I'm going to church one day. Yeah, you must come. Come on, church with Um, upstairs, Avian Plaza. Upstairs, Avian. Look at you. Are you feeling? Good? No pain? Awesomeness. Jesus Christ is still alive, you know. He's forever alive on the throne of glory. Yeah? Well, my name is Kerry. Kerry Christian. Kalita, tell them who did it for you. What's his name? Jesus. Jesus. And if he did it for you, he's going to do it for anybody, right? Amen. Healing is the children's breath. You got to know him and have a relationship with him. Jesus loves you. He's Lord God. Jesus loves you. Amen. Lord God, God bless you, love. You got to know him like you know your mommy and your daddy. 
Oh, you know your friend? You got to know him. He's your friend. That sticks closer.